Hi my little friends today we will learn about the flightless birds you all must be knowing birds fly in the sky but there are several birds that cannot fly so in this video we'll be learning about the flightless birds let us understand what are flightless birds flightless birds are birds that through evolution have lost the ability to fly there are over 60 extant species including the well-known reptiles that is the ostriches emu cassowaries rheas and kiwi and also penguins many domesticated birds such as the domestic chicken and domestic duck have also lost the ability to fly for extended periods the largest flightless bird which is also the largest living bird is the ostrich the smallest flightless bird is the inaccessible island rail let us check out the list of the flightless birds on top of our list we have the kiwi this flightless bird is a brown chicken sized bird and it is endemic to new zealand it is also the national icon of new zealand takai this bird is also found in new zealand it was considered to be extinct until it was rediscovered in the late 1800s weka this is another brown large sized flightless bird which is also endemic to new zealand kakapo another flightless bird from new zealand it is also known as the owl parrot it is large flightless leg breeding nocturnal ground dwelling parrot all species of penguins are flightless birds but this species which is called macaroni penguins or the royal penguins bear a distinctive yellow crest on their heads they are found in antarctica cassowary is another large species of flightless birds here we have the dwarf cassowary it is the smallest breed of cassowary and found in the new guinea new britain and yipen island Rhea is another species of flightless birds which is a distant relative of the ostrich and the emu. Here we have Darwin's Rhea which is also known as the lesser rhea. It has relatively larger wings enabling it to run particularly well and outrun its predators. It is found in Altipelago and Patagonia in South America. Domestic turkey This is a same species as the wild turkey and it is a popular form of poultry. This bird is native to North America and of course it's flightless. Emu. This bird is native to Australia. It is the second largest living bird by height and it is famous for its grey-brown plumage of shaggy appearance. Somali ostrich This bird was considered to be a subspecies of the common ostrich but was identified as a distinct species only in 2014. It is found in the Horn of Africa, particularly in Ethiopia and Somalia. Common ostrich. This flightless bird is the tallest, heaviest and biggest bird in the world standing at a height of 2.8 meters tall and a weight of 160 kg it can outrun plenty of animals with its top speed of 69 km per hour and it is native to africa after the biggest flightless bird we have the smallest living flightless bird in the world the inaccessible island ray this bird is only endemic to the inaccessible island in the Tristan archipelago in the isolated South Atlantic. Falkland steamer ducks. Native to the South of America, these birds are famously aggressive and they have been known to kill water birds several times their size. The flightless cormorant 
It is the only known cormorant that has lost its ability to fly and it is endemic to the Galapagos Island. Auckland Teal It is a nocturnal species of the dabbling duck and is endemic only to the Auckland Islands south of the New Zealand. Wearing the crown of the flightless birds, we have the Emperor Penguin. This bird is the fifth heaviest living bird species but it is a flightless bird. It stands up to 100 cm tall and with a weight of 22 to 45 kgs and is endemic only to Antarctica. Time to revise. Kiwi Takahi Weka Kakapo Domestic Turkey Somali Ostrich Emperor Penguin Emu Dwarf Cassowary All are flightless birds. And so my lovely dear friends, now it's time to say bye-bye. Hope you had a wonderful time watching this video and learnt about the flightless birds very well. I'll catch you in my next video. Please don't forget to like this video and subscribe to this channel and also leave your wonderful comments below. I'll see you next time. Bye-bye.